yeah, everyone, everyone's very excited. You know, we've had a few good games in the Premiership, built some momentum after the big one, a bit of good home form, and great game against Sale. So everyone's excited going into a bit of knockout rugby. What's the attitude been throughout this competition? Uh, unbeaten in the pool stage, and then a, a dogged result against Breed in the quarterfinals at home. Well, I think. It's obviously a bit of a chance for some of the English players to get a bit more game time and a few of the young boys, you know, I think wingers wise, Zach and Radders have been on fire really, scoring a lot of tries, making a lot of breaks. So it's been a great opportunity for a bit a slightly different side to play together. And I think we've all really enjoyed the brand we've been playing in the European. Like you said, the brief game we maybe didn't to have the accuracy, but we know we created the opportunities and going down to Gloucester we'll have to take those to come out victorious. Would you rather have had home advantage or when you get to the, sort of the last four, does it not really matter with the field that you're playing on? Uh, I think given how well we've been playing at home, it obviously would have been nice to have the crowd going again like last Friday night. But, uh, you know, we go down to Gloucester, it's maybe slightly easier to be the away team, there's slightly less pressure on you and we can go, go down there with sort of no expectations. I think it's been mentioned sort of in, in other interviews how it's the, the first appearance in the semi-finals for a number of years. Uh, what sort of things from... Elsewhere in your career, say the, the books and the, the students are be what can you draw on from experiences there in, in sort of these winner take all matches? I think like we've been talking about all week, it's just who's got the most points after eighty minutes wins it. It doesn't really matter about performance. It would obviously be nice to play some pretty nice flowing rugby, but it just comes down to who's got the most points. I think personally, yeah, the last semi final, apart from the Anglo Welsh was Bucks in my second year of uni and we won that and went on to win the final, so you know, me and Schwebby have got a bit of experience of that, but no, I think it's just a great place for the club to be that we've made semi-finals in both competitions.